So I've done a classic Loki thing. <laughs> so we've got, coming into the last two games of the season, we have a chance, an outside chance, of playoffs, which would be a fantastic season. Even if we don't get through, it's a bit of extra money. You know, all that good stuff. But, and obviously we can register players at any time because we're a little club. I signed a player who's really good, who fills in a lot of gaps and what I want to do. I've changed the tactic slightly. And he's arrived on trial until he signs his contract, which is like a day after the last game of the season. So if we make playoffs, we can use him because... Rules, I guess. Right, let's have a look. <music> Greetings and salutations, my friends. Oh, welcome back. So after, I think it was the Hungerford game where we got our youth intake, my thought was we were like just mid-table with a chance of playoffs. And I thought, well, we'll play a couple of games. And if we lose a couple more because we'd hit a little bit of bad, bad run of form, that I'd get some of those youth players that we've got and just give them some experience, end of the season, the games don't matter. But we scraped, and I do mean scraped, scraped some wins together, um, which means we've got an outside chance. So we beat uh, Dartford, was a really good uh, result. 94th minute penalty, lovely, which I think, no, it must, that can't be the one, because he, he missed one and then scored the rebound. Um, Brett has been sensational, lazy, but sensational. Uh, beat Horsham, who are just terrible, they are really bad, uh, worth getting the goals there. Um, and then a one all draw, Brad Alt F4, getting a lovely goal from a corner, and the league table is here, is thusly. Uh, only two points off, but there is other teams, so there's 40 games in a season, right? Okay, just mem <laughs> moments doubt. They've still got six games left. No, two points, but there is also another team in between as well, so we need other teams to slip up a little bit as well, multiple teams to slip up, in fact. Um, I haven't looked, so we're playing Dover, at home, who are mid-table, and away to top of the league. Who are already... <laughs> Who've only lost two games this season. Okay, yeah, it's less likely now. I said it was an outside chance. It's it's We're so far outside, we can see the people waiting outside. Um, and also, just for fun, uh, despite the fact we had a nice week break before this game, we had, like... Two weeks break before, no numbers, 11 days break before this one. They decided to play on the 4th, on the Saturday, and then the Monday. So, we also have a dead team. Uh, the tactic has changed slightly. It's, we just conceded too many goals. We needed, a, I, need, I, thought, I, I felt like we needed an extra body in midfield. Um, and also, at the time, Falco was injured. So, it was like, okay, or Wolf was injured. So, they only had one striker, main striker anyway. So, I'm like... I know we've got good strikers, but the system is more important than the strikers. And Brett's doing great, like set pieces and stuff, running about, not so much. Uh, Left-hand side is really weak. Whoever I play there is is turd on a stick. Um, and we don't have the most depth for midfield. We're okay with our injuries, but anything happens and we're a bit ropey. Um, just chilling out a little bit more, you know, don't go so aggressive. We've also signed a new player, um, Mbeo. Um, who I just signed on a whim that I probably shouldn't have. But uh, for a bit more squad depth, um, because I don't know what it is. I have this constant problem, right? This guy is factually shit at football. <laughs> we can all agree. Yeah, he can jump. He's got some decent acceleration. He can head. That's it, Right. But he's playing really well. <laughs> and despite it, I just... I just... But he's still shit. Even though technically... Well, he's not. He's like a second best performer, third best performer this season. But he's shit. He's got one and a half... Star. I don't know if, if it's just me that has this weird conundrum of... But I've got a four... I've got a four-star centre-back here. Why is he not playing? And I know, obviously, our scouts are crap and everything like that. So that makes more sense. But he... he like, I, he's legitimately dog-turd. But he, I can't not play him because he, he's just, you know, doing bits. Right, we've also signed long-term contracts for uh, Woof because they're adults now and I can actually give them contracts. Kian Fox, Woof, um, Tiffany Wetpants also has two years. Moody, two years. Leo, two years. So the, the main guys, good. 
and we'll do the rest of the contracts at the end of the season. But now I've got to find a fit team somewhere. Wolf cannot start because he's dead. We can train her and Eggy. So this is the new guy, Dylan McGlade. Uh, he's four-star current ability. He's a number 10 or can play on either side, but as an inside forward on the left. But I was like, he's really good. He's amazing. A little bit of flair, tries tricks at this level. He could dominate. But for some reason, he doesn't arrive till the 13th of, 13th of May. You know, that old date, that old chestnut. He doesn't arrive till the 13th of May. So I could just have him on trial for a bit so he can watch. Because I'd like to actually play a number 10. Maybe move these two central midfielders a little bit more defensive going forward. Maybe next season we do that because we don't have a player yet. Um, right. I think we just... This is a must win. I don't think four points is going to be enough. But if we don't win this game and then we've got a tall key, it doesn't matter. So I'm going to kind of play our main side pretty much and then make changes as needed, I think is the plan. Yeah. Uh, and we'll put you, we'll make Bayo can come on. I almost signed a player from the hotbed of football, which we all know is Madagascar. <laughs> I've never... Madagascar didn't that, but he wanted like 600 quid a week. Right, here we go. 100% must win game. A draw. And then Torquay in the last one. So it's always an outside chance. Uh, Dover an okay side. Good save, good save keeps. Come on, boys. It'd be a miracle. I like. I don't like. He, he realistically, even if we get to playoffs, I know it's you know it's, it's knockout competition. Anything can happen, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But no, <laughs> there are teams way like Maidstone are, you know, twenty points ahead us ahead of us for a reason. Okay, and this this is the reason mainly. It's it's uh okay. We're building into it. We needed to have a good first half because we have to make a load of subs. <clears throat> Hogan, there we go. Calm, calm, Hogs. Harding burst through the middle, but we clean up nicely. Go on, Braddy. O'Reilly. Okay. Just keeps getting the ratings. Like, let's let's, let's say, for instance, right? Are you the sort of person? Football manager, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. It might be offside. I don't think it is. It's bloody not. It's bloody not. Listen. Uh, are you just sort of, let, let's say this guy, let's take this O'Reilly for an example. If I, next season, he starts as the main centre back, like one of the main centre backs because he's done really well and we get promoted, he continues to get 7.3 average. Do I then play him? And if we, let's say we kept getting promoted and he kept doing that, would he end up in the, would you as a manager, a football manager, would you be playing him in the Premier League if he just never, 7.2s all the time? You know, I just can't. <laughs> right. Okay. We've got a one nil lead, but we are dead. Okay. Brad has to come off first. This is a shame. Um, We'll save the rest. It's not too bad because we're not quite as attacking as we once were. So it's... Let's just go cautious. Second half. Let's go. We are currently in the playoffs. <laughs> with Torquay to play. Well, the asterisk next to the league table. They've still got to play Torquay. Oh, you've got to pass it. You can't try and dribble out of defence like that, you nugget. Oh, that just seemed far too easy, didn't it? Okay, okay. That's okay, boys. That's okay. Maybe it's best that we lose now so we don't go hopeful into the last game. You know? I don't want to sound defeatist. <laughs> but, but I am. Right, so the draw's not good enough. We've got to go for the win here. And this is, this is the problem we've been having. Um... Lack of attacking midfielder. Right, let's go, boys. 
Let's go. 20 minutes. See what you got. <laughs> Technically, we could still get promoted on the last day of the season if it stays like this. But goals would be nice. Okay, Sally. Hian. Oh, just so bad. We desperately need another central midfielder. An attacking midfielder, a central midfielder. And a left winger. Okay, last chance saloon. And it's not a sending off. I was assuming it's that. What is that? What is that pass? Jesus. My blind nan. She's dead. That's a lie. I was going to make a blind nan joke, but you know, she's dead. Here we go. Go on. Scrap. Oh, no, no. I don't want the sending off. That was supposed to be a proper highlight. Okay. Okay. Go on, trainer. No, he's fucking dreadful. He's absolutely dreadful. He's a terrible footballer. He's a terrible human being. All right. Jesus. They had, they had a few shots. Added on time because of the sending off, yeah? Go on, Sully. Try and get... Okay. That's it. We can still do it. I think, right? It's still possible our goal difference is okay. <laughs> For now. Hey, goal drought. Okay. On to Torquay then. So I must win. I'm not going to look at their team because it would just be depressing. Right, Wolf, you're back in. Uh... <laughs> Such a load of shit. Right, and come in. Goalkeeper's improved. He was averaging six point five for a while. That's uh, that's okay. Right, trainer had a better game despite the miss. He had a better game. That's all I've got. Okay, here we go. Gonna take a minor miracle this one. <clears throat> Everybody seems to be happy. We're on a good run. Never know. You never know. It's one game. They might have already been on holiday. They're down at the beach. Might be their under twelves. Okay, we are in the white. Okay, let's not confuse ourselves. Okay, I almost celebrated that set piece. Okay, we're in it. We're in it. Corner ball. We are dangerous. Near posts. O'Reilly's there. If he, had, if he was a better player, he would have scored that. <clears throat> okay. Some members of the squad are sitting on train and doing better playing. Yes, I know. Go on. Go on. Go on. Back post. O'Reilly again. <sighs> Set of peace kings. Possession's okay. Pass completion's a bit ropey. That's to be expected. This is fine. Doesn't matter if we're getting outplayed. If we can just hold on. Nick it. It's doable. If we concede, we are doomed. Oh my God, look at the whippage on that. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Still hanging on, boys. Focus. It's a tiny bit one-sided. Here we go. That's the ball. That's the ball. Is he on? Is he on? Oh, he took too long. Wolf, you took too long. Oh, that was glorious. He was on side. Right. If we can get an 80th minute and then we, un at nil nil, we'll unleash. That's a ball. Yes. Yes. Keeper just phased through a post. We should maybe look into that. I'm sure there's a rule against that. Okay. Brady's looking. Okay, we're, the long ball over the top is working wonders. Woof! Oh! oh I can't believe it.
It seems to be working, so let's encourage that. They're playing with a very high line. Okay, Moody. Seems <laughs> This is as root one as you get. We've just had to chase them down. Oh, how have we not scored? And here comes the sucker punch. He's, mi <laughs> He's missed it. The goalkeeper had a... He, he had a dive. Oh, there it is. Oh, woof, mate, mate. You've got, to, you've got to do better than that, woof. See, what am I, what am I doing? What am I, do, what am I doing? Just bring on two strikers, lemon. Oh man. Let's go you. I don't know what I, I'm not going to score two goals, am I? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> oh, trainers from Snake, was it? Was it? We spotted a weakness in their team as well. We were hurting them. Save Moody. He's, Moody's done about all he can. Right away. I need to score now. They've edged it. I'm not suggesting we got lucky. <laughs> you know, put, like they say in the commentary, you know, but if we'd scored first, it would have just been a different game, right? I wonder how many times, if I was like a save scummer, you know, when we were kids, we all used to do the save scumming, right? What, how many times would I have to replay that? If I had to like, no, no, I'm going to win this game because I want to get promoted. I want to cheat my way to the top. I wonder how many times I'd have to, I'm always tempted to make an experiment, <laughs> like a separate thing. <laughs> no, that would just be really depressing getting smashed every game. Go on, Brett. If we, oh, I was going to say, if we score now, you never, no, no. Right, here we go. Launch one, Moody. Quickly, though. Okay, just about made it over the halfway line. Well done, mate. Okay. <clears throat> I reckon I'd have to play this 20 times. Because I feel like this is as close as we we're going to get, realistically. Okay, come on. We deserve a goal. Yes. Go on, trainer. Do something useful with your life. You're going to be a postman next year, so make the most of this last game. Nice one, Brady. Is this the killing blow? Here it comes. Feels like a killing blow. Good block. O'Reilly there. Well, we did. <laughs> wow. Don't look at the stats. We did as good as we could. I think, like, overall, all joking aside, this has been a remarkably good season back in you know our first time back in this division after promotion and to give as good as we've got oh, unnecessary is <laughs> don't send him off we're already 30 seconds over you absolute dickhead referee just blow that whistle Right, go on, save it. You've had a good game, Moody. Three! Go on! If we score now, I'm just going to be depressed. Right. We gave as good as we got. A little lap of honour for the Torquay fans. They've had a pretty decent, solid season. They got promoted about five games ago, so they've done all right for themselves. Let's have a quick... Yep, bad. <laughs> I can't believe you got this. Why? Why? See, look, the transfer window opens. I have a question. The transfer window opens in two days' time, right? The the playoffs start in about five days' time. In this league, you don't need to register. You can register players at any time. So, real-life situation. A team is in this position, and they're in the playoffs. Could you not? If you had a rich owner, could you not? Somebody that's running out of... Somebody, a really good player that's running out of contract, Right? Let's say Paul Pogba, right? Sign Pogba for a two-week contract. 
gets you promoted, you pay him 100 grand or maybe probably more than that, and then he can go off to his next club. Huh? Huh? Loophole. Right, let's <laughs> let's get to the end of the season. On McGlade would have been really, really useful right about now, wouldn't he? He would have been great for the last couple of games. <sighs> Well, um, yeah, the board extremely disappointed with the deal to sign Dean Brett. What, the guy with 18 goals and 13 assists? This is mainly due to both the transfer fee and the player's wage being of a high side, making this four grand and 200 quid a week. And he got us 18 goals and 13 assists. Okay. Uh, yep, yeah, they're pleased. Okay, good. Yep. Yeah. Big win. Yeah, back in back in the day. Uh, sponsorship's gone up because obviously promotion. <laughs> Two hundred eighty-eight quid last season. Wow, it's quite a difference, isn't it? It's quite a difference. Uh, Woof, Buckley, Brad, Falco, and Smith probably should have black lettering. I feel like on those shirts, but okay, you do you. Uh, Five hundred six seventy-five shirts. I think it was like fifty-five last season. The club's reputation has increased from local to regional. <laughs> Woo! Well, that actually might be really big because now they can relocate. We know our best eleven. We don't need to worry about it. Fans player of the season, Brett. Brad of the young player of the season. Brett signing of the season. Woof, goal of the season. Falco top scorer with 19. Brett with 13 assists. Brett with 10 man of the matches. That terrible signing we made. Brett with 7.4. Uh, Buckers makes the most passes. Okay, so... Broken records, Falco. He's a legend of the club at this point. 54 goals, 107 appearances. Uh, highest transfer. It'll probably be a while before we break that one, I reckon. Quickest goal, 38 seconds for Faith. Well done. Uh, brilliant stuff. Right. Let's have a quick look. I, we already know what we need. As well as anything else I can find, obviously, it's slim pickings. We need a left winger. 100% we need a left winger. Probably the most important position. We need a good defensive ball-winning midfielder. We've already got the attacking version coming in. So it's it's not a massive amount. I don't know how good Brett is going to be for a second season. No, he's okay. He's fine. He'll be fine. Um, but we do need backup for him. So wingers. And maybe a backup left back. A better backup left. Maybe a right back. But the most important thing is ball-winning midfielder. And a left winger. That's that's the key to it all. And I think what they allow us to do is when in the games we're at home that we think we've got a better chance, we can just swap to a number 10. And then for the talkies of this world, we can play with the DM like we just did, try and defend our way out of it sort of thing. Right. Overall, double thumbs up for that season. Uh, finances are looking terrible. Um, the board have put in a bit of money over the course of the season. There's not much you can do about that. Even if I whacked the wage budget down to two grand, or I'm currently spending two grand, a grand a week stuff, we still make a massive loss. You kind of have to rely on the board. A takeover would be quite nice, but uh, it's fine. It's fine. And we've got some very good youth players setting the wings. Unfortunately, didn't have a chance to give them sort of game time this season because we were running for playoffs. But I want to give them, maybe just look for, well, no, the 17. Maybe look for some loan out smooths the 17 now. Wilson's 17. Yeah, not too bad. Right, there we go, my friends. We are done for the day. There's a small, there's a 18% chance there is no Ukraine video tomorrow. Because the transfer window might take me forever. <laughs> but but if so you'll know if there's not but there should be i'll get on to it now right thank you very much for watching as always i love you lots thank you for the support i'll see you next time bye bye